What's up? Gus Kenworthy here. Super excited to be partnering with Petco. We have three dogs, Bronx, Max, and San Diego, up for adoption from the Animal Care Center of New York. Any athlete can tell you that a lot of hard work goes into competing, into getting ready for competitions, and it's the exact same with these dogs. I mean, we're trying to give them a leg up on the competition. We're trying to get them bathed, teach them a couple tricks, and getting them ready for their forever homes. The ASPCA says that 7.6 million companion animals enter shelters each year. Some of these animals are returned to their owners and other animals are made available for adoption. And of those animals for adoption, only about half of them will find their forever homes. Every year, Petco and Petco Foundation partner with more than 4,000 animal welfare organizations to find homes for more than 400,000 pets. Since the Petco Foundation was established in 1999, they've spent more than $157 million to help animals in need. This is Bronx. Bronx is a Staffordshire mix. He's six years old. He's one of the amazing dogs that's available for adoption. This guy is Max. He is two years old. He's a Brittany mix. Unfortunately, the owner's son was allergic to dogs, so they had to surrender him, but he's a really great, sweet pet. Gentle. He's really gentle. This is San Diego. She's two years old. She was found walking around in the middle of the highway. She just needs someone to take care of her. One thing that every shelter needs is more resources. These resources can be human volunteers, it can be monetary donations, it can be food, it can be supplies, but everyone needs help. Today we are making sure that we are picking up the proper supplies for Max, Bronx, and San Diego, but there are so many other cats and dogs and animals that need adoption, so we're going to make sure we pick up some supplies for them too. Let's grab one of these monster yeah, ones. One. Yup. Definitely you. Did you find anything you're looking for today? Yeah, I think so. I don't know. We just got a couple things, just a few small couple things. things. <laughs> Thanks very much. It's sometimes hard to see how cute these dogs are going to be when they're a little bit dirty and they're in their kennel, but you get them out, you give them a bath, you brush their teeth, and it's like a whole new dog right in front of you. Ten percent of dogs that are given to shelters or to animal welfare groups are done so because of behavioral issues. And the Petco trainers help teach these dogs basic commands like sit, stay, shake, to try and help them with their adoptability and make them more enticing for a new owner. Now it's the hardest part, it's time to say goodbye. However, I do really believe that every animal has a perfect forever home and I just urge you if you're thinking of adding a pet to your family to think adoption first and see if there's a way for you to adopt a dog because you'll be making a huge difference in that dog's life and in your own.